My name is Bart Vargas. I'm a resident here at the Carver Bank. Um, I'm from Bellevue, Nebraska originally, and I'll be a resident here from April of 2013 to March of 2014. I have an existing practice of being a, a sculptor, a painter, an educator. Um, with my artworks, I tend to salvage materials and make uh, paintings and sculptures out of salvaged materials, either trash or recyclables that weren't needed or wanted anymore. You know, we live in this era where um, we talk about limitations and budgets and, and um, just resources and as an artist I find that there's just so much of it there's just so much available in materials if we just look at their potential most of the physical materials I get are for free um, or essentially no cost to me I salvage a lot of paint from um, under the sink which is the county collection site for Douglas Sarpy County where people bring in their household chemicals and and things to be disposed of which not having a choice in the color, um, I feel is kind of a challenge to, to play with what I get. A lot of the cardboard sculptures, a lot of the plastic sculptures, a lot of the wood I build these things out of come out of dumpsters and recycling bins. Like everyday domestic objects become uh, like, they're still everyday domestic objects, but have them become a piece of art. Like here at Carver Bank, my original goal was to work on sculpture. I've been playing with a lot of geometry and a lot of like uh, polyhedrons. I've been pushing myself to build really complex polyhedrons. Like this is 192 different different um, bases that make this sphere. I'm gonna, my goal is to paint the earth on, on the globe and I'm gonna make another couple keyboard spheres where I've taken apart keyboards and using the keys to essentially make a mosaic that makes up the map of the earth. I like my work to be optimistic and fun and playful and approachable. I, I just finished a series of paintings that all said yes. There was like about 188 yeses on the wall and it's all just bright colors. Um, just this bombardment of positivity, this bombardment of yes. Here at Carver Bank, it's really a community. Um, everybody knows each other. When I work during the day, people come through the studio space all the time, and it's great talking to people who have questions, um, seeing what I'm doing, or just catching up with, with other residents. I never saw myself with a social practice, but looking back at the last six months, it's it's kind of blossomed. I have done a lot out in the community working with um, like the state education associations and things. You know, having been around the United States and having been around Europe and parts of Asia, um, Art is culture. You know, art is a very human thing. I don't think art is expendable. I don't think it's something that we can just live without. You know, if you ask me in a year when the residency's done, um, how much has the neighborhood affected the work, I could probably have a clearer answer. But like swimming right in the middle of it, it's still a little gray. But like when I work with my students, I tell them, like when they're asked to write about influence and stuff, I, I remind them that everything influences you. Your subconscious is working 24-7. There's a lot of art happening in this neighborhood and I'm excited that to be included amongst that group.